Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in this video we are going to see two problems on electric flux density. Okay, so in that first problem is this. Right, if you are first time to my channel, please consider subscribing and hit the bell icon to get video notifications from my channel. Right, uh, we will see the first problem. So he has asked to determine d bar okay is asked to find determine d bar at 403 that is point of interest is now 403 if there is a point charge of minus 5 pi milli coulomb at 4 comma 0 comma 0 and a line charge of 3 pi milli coulomb per meter along y axis okay so he has asked us to find d bar which is equal to d1 bar plus d2 bar okay so this d1 bar is due to the point charge okay and d2 bar is due to line charge d2 bar is due to line charge okay so first of all we will find d1 and d2 so d1 bar is due to point charge so electric flux density due to point charge is given by q by 4 pi r square a r cap okay so q by 4 pi r square into r bar by r okay so r cup is r bar by r so what is r bar okay so it is the dis difference between the point of interest point of interest is 4 comma 0 comma 3 and point charge is at 4 comma 0 comma 0 4 comma 0 comma 0 okay so 4 comma 0 comma 0 so if you take the difference what you'll get 0 comma 0 comma 3 0 comma 0 comma 3 so if you write in vector form it will be 3 az cap r bar is 3 az cap and r is 3 okay so root of 3 square which is 3 right so what is q value q value is minus 5 pi milli coulomb so i am substituting that so minus 5 pi into 10 to the power of minus 3 divided by 4 pi into r value r cube so r square into r here so r cube r cube is 3 cube okay 3 cube into r bar is 3 a z cap okay so 5 pi 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 gets cancelled right so 3 1s are 3 9s are right so if you uh, do this right so using your calci what you will get is I'll write in milli coulomb only okay so it will be minus 0 0.139 mil az cap sorry az cap milli coulomb per meter square so d bar, d bar units are coulomb per meter square okay next so this is of you can find d bar due to point charge next is d2 bar d2 bar is due to line charge so given by the formula rho l by 2 pi rho rho bar sorry a rho cap no so it will be a rho cap so rho l by 2 pi rho into rho bar by rho again so what is rho bar so again it is the difference between the point of interest point of interest is 4 comma 0 comma 3 minus y axis y axis is 0 comma so here y value is also 0 so i am writing 0 so on y axis only y coordinate will exist since y coordinate given is also 0 so i am taking 0 here so it will be 4 comma 0 comma 3 so if you write in vector form it will be 4 a x plus 3 a z 3 a z so rho bar is root of 16 plus 9 which is equal to 5 okay so if you find d2 bar is equal to rho l rho l is 3 pi 3 pi into 10 to the power of minus 3 okay divided by 2 pi into so here rho and here also rho so rho into rho is rho square rho square is 25 
रो स्क्वायर इज ट्वेंटी फाइव इंटू रो बार रो बार इज फोर ए एक्स कैप प्लस थ्री ए जेड कैप सो पाई एंड पाई गेट्स कैंसिल सो इफ यू फाइंड थ्री बाई फिफ्टी सो थ्री बाई फिफ्टी राइट थ्री बाई फिफ्टी इंटू फोर सो डी टू बार इज थ्री बाई फिफ्टी इंटू फोर ए एक्स कैप प्लस थ्री बाई फिफ्टी इंटू थ्री ए वाई कैप मिली कुलूम पर मीटर स्क्वायर सो इफ यू फाइन दिस वैल्यू यूल गेट इट एज जीरो पॉइंट टू फोर जीरो पॉइंट टू फोर ए एक्स कैप प्लस जीरो पॉइंट वन एट ए वाई कैप मिली कुलूम पर मीटर स्क्वायर okay so this is how we can find the d bar for a line charge so the total flux density is the sum of individual flux densities due to uh, point charge and line charge so it will be z minus 0.139 az cap plus 0.24 ax cap plus 0.18 ay cap so the answer will be d bar is equal to 0.24 ax cap minus 0.041 az cap milli coulomb per meter square milli coulomb per meter square okay so this is how we can solve any question if they are asked for different types of charges that is for one is for point charge and that is for line charge okay so from this what can we conclude is d bar that is flux density also obeys it also obeys superposition principle it also obeys superposition principle okay so we'll see the next problem right question number 2 So in this, he has given that a point charge is there, right, of 30 nanocoulomb at origin, and the plane y is equal to minus 3 carries a charge 10 nanocoulomb per meter square. Right, so that is surface charge density is given, and he has asked to find d bar at 0 comma 4 comma 3. So this is our point of interest now. Okay, so this is our point of interest. So how to solve this? Same d bar is equal to d one bar plus d two bar. So d one bar is due to point charge. Okay, and d two bar is due to surface charge. Right. So first of all, we'll solve for d one bar. So d one bar is given by q by four pi r square into a r cap. Okay, so Q by four pi r square into r bar by r. Okay, so what is r bar? R bar is point of interest. That is zero comma four comma three minus the location where this point charge exists. That is at origin. So it is existing at origin. So it will be zero comma zero comma zero. So it will be zero comma four comma Three. So, if you write in vector form, it will be four a y cap plus three a z cap. So, r will be five root of sixteen plus nine root of twenty five, which is equal to five. Okay. So, q. What is q given? Thirty nanocoulomb. So, thirty into. So, we'll keep it in uh, nanocoulomb only. Okay. So, thirty. I will take. By four pi into r cube, so r square into r, r square into r is r cube, so r cube is five cube, which is equal to one twenty five into so r bar, r bar is four a y cap plus three a z cap, four a y cap plus three a z cap, so. Uh, if you do, what will happen? So if you solve this, okay. So directly, if you solve this, what will you get is zero point zero seven eight two ay cap plus zero point zero five seven two 
ए जेड कैप नैनो कुलम पर मीटर स्क्वायर नैनो कुलम पर मीटर स्क्वायर सिमिलरली डी टू बार डी टू बार इज ड्यू टू सरफेस चार्ज सरफेस चार्ज फॉर्मला इज रो एस बाई टू ए एन कैप ओके सो वाई इज इक्वल टू माइनस थ्री इज द प्लेन सो वाई इज इक्वल टू नेगेटिव सो वाई इज इक्वल टू नेगेटिव इज द प्लेन सो इट्स नॉर्मल इज रो एस बाई टू इन टू प्लस ए वाई कैप ओके सो प्लस ए वाई कैप वॉट इज रो एस वैल्यू गिवेन टेन नैनो कुलोम सो यू विल कीप दट इन नैनो कुलम ओनली सो इट विल बी टेन बाई टू ए वाई कैप ओके सो टेन बाई टू ए वाई कैप विच इज इक्वल टू फाइव ए वाई कैप नैनो कुलम पर मीटर स्क्वायर ओके सो डी बार टोटल डी बार इज इक्वल टू डी वन बार प्लस डी टू बार सो डी वन बार इज जीरो पॉइंट जीरो सेवन एट टू ए वाई कैप प्लस जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव सेवन टू ए जेड कैप प्लस डी टू बार इज फाइव ए वाई कैप सो टोटल नैनो कुलम पर मीटर स्क्वायर सो इट विल बी फाइव पॉइंट जीरो फाइव पॉइंट जीरो सेवन एट टू ए वाई कैप प्लस जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव सेवन टू ए जेड कैप नैनो सॉरी नैनो कुलम पर मीटर स्क्वायर ओके सो दिस इज द फाइनल वैल्यू फॉर यूर इलेक्ट्रिक फ्लक्स डेंसिटी और इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड डिस्प्लेसमेंट ओके सो दिस इज हाउ वी कैन सॉल्व फॉर ईच एंड एवरी प्रॉब्लम फॉर डी बार ओके मे बी यू मे बी आस्क फॉर पॉइंट चार्ज और यू मे बी आस्क फॉर लाइन चार्ज और यू मे बी आस्क फॉर सर्फेस चार्ज सो यू हैव टू रिमेंबर ऑल थ्री फॉर्मुलर्स एंड यू हैव टू सॉल्व लाइक दिस Okay